Okay, Antonia. And what is your heritage background? Um, well, my grandparents are from Jamaica, both of them, or four of them actually. <laughs> and I was born in Birmingham. Give yourself in three words. Oh, three words. Me, <laughs> more than three, give me ten. Uh, three words, okay. Um, underestimated. Yeah. <laughs> um, I'm going to say one of a kind because it's not one word but it's like three words in one. Okay. Yeah, it's like a phrase. And extraordinary. One, two, three. Who else inspires you? Um, well, Michael Jackson inspires me. I think the things that he's been through is really underestimated. So he got a lot of negative press but he still, you know, kept going. He still was doing the performance. He knows a lot of pressure for a man of his age. And he's always got a positive, like, um, a positive moral to his sons, which I really like. Like, man, it's always like he always wanted better for us, and I like that. So people just need to listen. Really. Favorite Michael Jackson album? <sighs> Number one. <laughs> but Ben's my favorite song. Okay. Yeah. Um, and also, you're from Jamaica as well. Um, favorite Jamaican artist? Well. Um, So that's why I have to do something with myself so that when I'm sitting down in 10 years next to, you know, Mr. Osborne, whatever, um, you know, I have something to show. So that's what motivates me. Zup, zup, zup. Okay. Um, random question. I heard you take part in a company called Adlib. Tell us a bit about that. Well, Adlib started about three and a half years ago. And uh, we put on a uh, monthly open mic night. We're an events management team and we put on a monthly open mic, mic night in Comedy Cafe in Old Street and that's been going on for two and a half years now. And we, um, we create a platform basically for artists, comedians, poets, singers and it's quite a successful night actually. It sells out every month so yeah that's, that's something I'm part of at the moment. Okay, you're from Jamaica, lived in Jamaica. Went to school in Jamaica, lived in Birmingham, lived in London, Manchester. You've been around London quite a bit. What's your favourite dish to eat? Uh, well, I like seafood, so anything prawns orientated is a winner for me. Anything seafood orientated, actually, I'll always get the prawns. So, Antonio Osborne, why should you win Miss Black Britain? Uh, I think I should win because, other than the fact that you won't find anyone else like me, I like to take on new roles and I like to go beyond what is expected of me and I like to work alongside other people while doing that. So I think I'd be perfect for this role and I'd bring the organisation and myself to a new platform. Basically.